What is up, guys? Welcome to another episode of Drivecast. This is episode 46, and we're here with CJ Speedway and Jay. And today we have a good few topics in hand. I keep looking that way, thinking my camera's over there when it's really over there. This is really weird. Anyway, topics today. We're going to be talking about what we got for Christmas, uh, as well as New Year's resolutions, um, what we think is going to happen in a year's time in terms of our own separate channels, and maybe even Drivecast itself. Um, and we're also going to talk about the Cruise New Video Mode, J sub count, and then obviously all the Q&A questions with a few more topics in between. Um, but firstly, we should talk about the kind of elephant in the room, which is why Niner isn't with us today. Yep, so last week, last week, there was no elephant in the room and the nigga wasn't here. Okay, so basically, <laughs> when, uh, when, uh, how, why is Niner not here? So, uh, it's not really easy to say. Obviously, we all know Christmas was yesterday, um, 25th yeah. for all of us. Uh, if you, I mean, some of you guys don't celebrate Christmas, that's cool. Hanukkah, you know, the, the, the celebration of lights or whatever. Kwanzaa, whatever Kwanzaa, the celebration of fruit. Yeah, niggas will fake Christmas. Anyway, yeah. um, so nina obviously went to i think where where did he go for christmas he went somewhere near Anaheim. la for christmas Anaheim. nigga don't say where he, exactly where he <laughs> went you fucking retard um he went somewhere near la and uh he got a bit crunk we were in a skype call uh it was like late for me and jay and then it would i don't know when it was for cj and speedway was there as well um but it was late for us i think it was, like, it, was it would have been boxing day for us which is obviously the 26th and it was late over there for nina and nina I know we saw him smoking something, and all I all I remember is before the call cut out was him there. I don't even know what he was doing. He was just like, I, I can't even explain. All, all I know is that he was smoking some dank Kush, and then the call dropped. And then the yeah. whoop, 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 and he hasn't been back since. So he might have OD'd for all we know. Um, he might be in the forest. The five, he might be in the forest naked. <laughs> the five one, the five ten, better five one zero. Oh. Whatever you call, I'm, uh, that's really I'm, good. I'm, I'm, I'm done. Kill yourself. I, I messed Kill up. Yourself. Uh, uh, uh. By the way, CJ has new posters, new mic. <laughs> Nigga, we gonna talk about that when it comes. Talk? To, we gonna talk you, about that when it comes. We gonna talk about that. What we got for Christmas? But first, we need to talk about Nina because that's kind of really sad. So, yeah. Nina, we hope you're okay. Uh, we legit don't know anything about him i know he's got a video planned for today so that's probably going to go up at some point but as far as that we don't know anything about nina so nina hope you're okay we hope the cush didn't get to your head anyway should we go on to the next topic uh yeah sure <laughs> you know there's gonna be people uh, in the first, comments like, um moment of silence for nina just in case anything kill yeah. yourself no yeah. kill yourself he didn't die he right. just probably stunned he as might have died i don't know i'm scared i'm scared i legit am <laughs> um anyway we're gonna go to the next topic and we're not going to cover this so much because last week was the drivecast awards which i think went down really goddamn well uh forgot to make those graphics maybe next yes. year <laughs> no, no one cares <laughs> maybe next the year awards. The Drivecast yeah. Awards, I think it was an amazing episode of Trash. Drivecast. I legit actually think that was one of the best episodes we've ever done. Trash. It was just so fun. Yeah, you're just mad because you weren't there because you were Yeah, there. you were not here. But, uh... Trash. Yeah, the most, like... The can most you, relevant do you mind letting me yeah. finish? Nope. Can we stem it? Can we Do it! <laughs> do it! Just do it! <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, uh, obviously, uh, last week um, was Drivecast Awards. So I won't talk about this too much. But this is uh, the year episode of Drivecast. Like this time last year, we had started Drivecast. No, it was so on the twenty fourth. Was it? No, yeah, yeah, kind of. You know. See, he agrees because I'm right. CJ, CJ, no, 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 no. CJ. I say, in the current say, format, I... it's a year anniversary of Drivecast because we do it on Saturdays. Does that make sense in your little head now? Huh? Okay, I don't know what you're doing. Like giving the fucking blowjob <laughs> to your fucking mic, but um, <laughs> yeah. It's been a, it's been a year of drivecast, so absolutely mad. We won't talk about it too much again. We kind of talked about a lot a lot of that last week when just we were just reflecting on the year's memories. But congratulations, guys! We've made it for a year. Made it for a year. Some, me, I think me and CJ are the only ones that are on the original episode before we rebooted. So after the we, first episode, and then we rebooted with the Mexican, and then obviously everyone else came on board. Um, the, the Mexican. But it's been it's been good though. It's been good. It's been a good year. And uh, thanks for everyone who's been supporting so far. Now, let's go to the first real topic, which is what we got for Christmas. So CJ, you can go first. All right, um, I'm gonna make this real simple for y'all. I got these JVC stereo headphones 
basically, if you realize the past couple of weeks, I've had really shitty. You can't hear us right now, so we can say whatever the fuck you want, CJ. You're a fucking yeah. retard. I've, I've, I've um, had really <laughs> shitty, <laughs> really shitty five below headphones, but whatever. Before that, I also got a new mic stand. The arm. Type going stand. Your room. What? What's wrong with my room, asshole? Whatever. I also got. <laughs> and I also got the AT 2020 mic right here. And I also got some more posters for my wall back there. One's coming soon. But I also got Grand Theft Auto 5 poster for it. And a uh, Need for Speed Rivals poster is going up there very soon, fellas. So. Exotic fanboy at his prime. Why didn't you get an underground poster? Because there weren't well, none on Amazon. Why didn't you get a Need for Speed Most Wanted poster? There weren't none on Amazon. Whatever. Um, I didn't want an undercover one because I didn't. Well, eh. um, no, I'll kill yourself. So you preferred Rivals to undercover? Yeah. Um, kill yourself. Kill yourself. Then I also got a bunch of stuff in my stocking, some DJ's money, and that's really it. And a Wawa gift card, so I'm cool. And that's it. A Wawa gift card? Uh, someone go next. I finished, basically. Does Jay want to go next? Because I honestly didn't get much this year. Um, I got nothing. You go next. All right. So I got lots of chocolates. They're actually, they're all basically here. Yeah, I'll show you. Shit ton of chocolates. Yes. Uh, chocolate! Chocolate! <laughs> no, they're, they're really nice chocolates though. So, and then I got that fucking pillow in the background, which is always going to stay in the background of all my videos. By the way, subscribe <laughs> to his channel if you didn't know already. Just yeah. subscribe to his channel. Um, I'm trying to think of shit I, I got. I legit didn't actually get much. Um, I've got some speed hunter stuff coming like tomorrow. No, is it really? Oh yeah, and I got um, Fast and Furious Showdown for 3DS, which I'll show you right here. I'm sending that back. That was 20 pounds. Um, but I'm sending that shit back. And that was it. That was literally all I got. <laughs> Not much, and I got some t-shirts and some... I got like 40 pounds for money. Didn't really much. But it's all good. The, the, the food was popping. We had the turkey. We had the gammon. We had the motherfucker. We had the set of the pockets. We had the lip up. We had the, uh, the, the pig from blankets. And it was it was all popping like in polka dotting. So I've got to say, overall, good day. And now here comes New Year's, which is going to be interesting. So... Dinner presents. And now, Speedway, what did you get? Nothing. I mean, I, I don't know if beers count. Like, beers count, definitely beers. <laughs> How beers. many beers? Like five. 35? <laughs> did five, I hit 35? Five. 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 Yeah. So was that enough for you to, you know, get a bit loose? Are you a lightweight? Yeah. I mean, it, it was cool. They were Russian beers, so. They, they were strong. They, it, it's like, wow. They were so strong as yeah, webcam right. pros. My He's webcam froze. My webcam. <laughs> froze. I, I kind of. Yeah, I'm calm. You know what? No, it's you know, fine. It's fine. It was fine. <laughs> 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 oh, that's not fucking bad. Okay, okay, there we go. Okay, now, now it works. You yeah, lucked yeah, out, buddy. Why, you lucked out. That's, that's, shut the fuck up. That's basically what I got. <laughs> so, yeah. So, overall. To be honest, it was a bit of an uneventful Christmas. Hoping next year will be better for me. Um, I didn't even, hold on, did you guys even make a Christmas tree? Because I did. I have a real I Christmas didn't. tree. Definitely cut down one. Yeah, I cut down one. Take one though, my bag. Red Jesus, I'm like, bring it from the ground up and, no. But yeah, Sorry, no. because you guys have pine, yeah, you have pine oh. trees in there. Like we don't, and we usually have like plastic trees. Yeah, a lot, of, yeah a lot of families do. I think it's it's very much 50-50 whether people have real trees or fake trees over here, yeah, from what I know. Yeah, the same here. Like, it depends, really. Fake trees are messy. Fake, no, fake, fake trees. Real trees, even, sorry. Fake trees are a lot more practical, but real trees have a smell to them, which are kind of just... Oh, yeah. You just what the fuck? Are you a... Are you, <laughs> are you a bear? What, 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 what? Does the smell of pine arouse you? What oh, is going on here? No, the problem is that instead of he, he smells a tree because instead of snow he puts cocaine in it. So he's like oh. <sighs> Hey hey, we shouldn't make him eat, making these jokes after Nina isn't here. Uh, oh, sorry, yeah. Uh, yeah, kids don't take drugs. I know. Um, that message. Don't so yeah, what did you guys get for Christmas is the next question, I guess. Like, what did the viewers get? I know a lot of people, because uh, a few people were talking me on Christmas Day. Uh, someone got a PS4, which was mad. Uh, obviously, I imagine a lot of you guys got like uh, Need for Speed and that kind of stuff, the crew. 
uh, which is good. A lot of people got old 360 games, which I wasn't expecting, like Most Wanted and Midnight Club and that kind of stuff. So again, really cool. So yeah, overall, what did you get for Christmas? Do you not celebrate Christmas? Do you celebrate the the, the, the Festival of Lights, Kwanzaa or Hanukkah or whatever it is? Uh, whatever you celebrate, let us know down below and tell us what you got, because I'm actually kind of interested to see what people got for Christmas. I've seen some mad tweets though, like, I just, because you know how, like, Slap Train, AR12, and Theo, they all tweet, like, oh, what did you get for Christmas? Because they've also got a lot more people to ask. And I don't know, some of the replies, like, I got an Apple Watch, and I got a PS4, even though I've already got an Xbox One, and then I got a motherfucking, I got a car, and I got this, and I got that. And like, people are literally, I don't, I, it's, how can you spend that much on one day? For one day? It's, I don't, it's mad to me. But Nikki, if you got the money, do it. I don't give a fuck. Not like you, nigga. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. If you got the money, uh, lend some. Yeah. <laughs> if I had the money to get an Apple Watch, a car, another console, nigga, I'd do that shit. I'll, I'll, no, I'd go ahead, pause the, do that shit, but I, I can't. So. Yeah, let's no, know what you Christmas. Yeah, but like basically, if you have a lot of money, just me and Jake, we're running right now a charity case for us too. So if you want, just lend us some money. <laughs> Not but you, just you and Jay. Do you know what I mean? The autistic kid. The autistic yeah. kid. She needs a cure. I'm the only one supporting his cure. Okay? What? So, if you want to send some money to mine and CJ's charity to cure CJ's autism, which is much more important, give us, you know, money is definitely needed. I used the money to buy this. Jesus Christ. See, look, look at that. Look at that. Jesus Christ. Help right now. Is that not... Is it, do, do, do I buy? If you want to donate, Cameron Gale, <laughs> dot UK at PayPal. Do it. Um... But anyways, we're going to the next topic go. Oh. Next topic go. It's New Year's resolutions and what we think of them. So firstly, before we get into this, has anyone got any New Year's resolutions? Yep. Yep. Go on then. <laughs> okay, can I can I say a meme and then the real thing after? Because <laughs> I, want, I wanted to just go in and go meme but I, I want to kind of be serious. Okay. You want to get a career GT, you know, don't you? No. <laughs> in all fairness, I want to get out a bit more. <laughs> is that like, a meme or is that serious? No, this is real. I'll, I'll, I'll do it the op opposite way. I want to get out more, you know, do more things, go to more restaurants, eat more food, different more kinds sex. of food. <laughs> See, that links to what I was going to say after. So. Yeah. It, it, um, <laughs> yeah. And then I guess the second thing I kind of want to go into is implants. I really want a big ass, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get silicone implants, and I'm gonna build a career on that and become famous with my implants. So you're going to be JB Kardashian? Yeah, I'm basically gonna be the number one big ass to YouTuber. See, what I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking more JV Minaj if with a big ass. <laughs> 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 I'm thinking JV Minaj presents <laughs> Hooning in Ventura ass. Yeah, I'll just yeah. drive in my ass out the window. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, does anyone else have any New Year's resolutions? Because uh, I know me and Speedway have the same opinion on this, so we can talk about this uh, together, babe. Uh, for me, it's to be more social in like my social life. I mean, I've started kind of doing that maybe this year, but this year I want to be able to actually be more social. No. Uh, if you... Last year, like in the beginning of this year and last year, I was probably one of the most antisocial kids you'll ever meet. And I was basically, yeah, I just, I was very, like, not outgoing at all, and I was really shy and stuff. But I guess sometime around this summer and stuff like that, I've kind of started opening up more. And now, this year, I want to be more more social like I was <laughs> later this year. So, yeah. Repeat himself, like, three times. <laughs> I want to be more social. I want to be more social. But um, you know, I I found I wasn't social. I want to be more social. I uh, you know, you know uh, I wasn't that's social, like, but I want to like be more social. When you when you're doing an exam and you want to get, you have to hit the word limit. <laughs> Young Walla baby. Um, oh. so I haven't really got a New Year's like specific resolution, as we'll talk about in a minute. Um, I've got like goals though. I've always got goals. Uh, what first goal? Uh, and this is this is a New Year's resolution. I will say that much. It's at the end of my videos. I have an outro, and it says last video, but I always forget to do the annotation. <laughs> so forget. my goal is to my goal is to Amen. just do that annotation. I've actually uploaded a video just now without that annotation. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, that's not 2016 yet. Resolution. Not 2016 yet. So you still have some time. And my overall goal 
is to get into a point with YouTube where I can do it full time. That's it. Simple as that. I, I, I want to be making it rain that YouTube money. I want to be surviving off this shit. This shit is my living. Uh, and that's it. That's that's all. That's literally that is my life at the moment. <laughs> Get them dollaroos. Um, but I think New Year's resolutions are bullshit. And I'm gonna explain why. So Speedway, do you want to lead? Bitch, I didn't even see my New Year's resolution, bitch. Oh, you have a New Year's resolution. Oh, okay, go, go. Yeah, of course, I have the notations. And then I had to agree, agree with Jay. He said in part of you know. Getting implants. Because I mean, uh, I, I have a really yeah. nice ass. You know, I have a really nice ass. Sorry, man. Uh, but no, I'm just <laughs> uh, But yeah, also, I'd be a little bit more social. I went to like more social activities, like get out, because with my career in university, I haven't been able to do that, even though I have friends and shit. So we always say, like, dude. Uh, do you want to hang out next week? And then we have an exam or some shit like that. And we can we, we can never do it. So I don't know. Is that getting laid? Beer. Ja, 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 yeah. ja, ja. Smack that gay on the floor. Smack. Yeah, basically that. Well, I get um, laid every weekend, so I, I, that's not really a resolution for me, so. Ah, uh, yeah. I get you, man. Then anyway. It's just boring now. <laughs> it's just boring. It's just too much. I get um, too much, man. I need to run. I need to run because I'm, I'm feeling it. It's coming through my veins. Can you can you see that? No. Nope. So that's a rant. Anyway, uh, I think New Year's resolutions are bullshit. I think if you're going to set yourself a resolution, you should do it anytime, anywhere, just because it's a new year. New year, new me. Bullshit. Why don't you just do it now? What's stopping you doing it now? Why Why have you got to wait till do the new year? Bullshit. It's all bullshit. New Year's resolutions. Nigga, I've been trying <laughs> to put the fucking annotations on my videos. I forget. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, 2016, after a day, I'm probably bound to forget. It's not a user, it's just a goal in my head. You, New Year's resolutions are bullshit. If you want to have change, just do the change now. Do the change in the middle of the summer. Do it on your birthday. It doesn't matter. My name's Cam, and I'm a motivational speaker. No, 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 no. You are Shia LaBeouf right now. Just not do it. Yeah. Just do it. New Year, do me. Why are you new waiting till January the 1st? What does that mean? It ain't got the answers, Sway. You new ain't got the answers. Bullshit, that's I, what it is. New Year, I, I, bullshit, I, I that's what it is, Niggy. I swear I actually God. agree with Cam, but if, because if you want the key of success, you can do it every single day. You know? yeah. When people close the door on you, you just, you just open You it. open it. That's the, that's the key to success. You don't wait for other people to open the door on the 1st of January. You do that shit today. You open the door open and you, you door. walk through the door. That's they don't want you to open the door, they though. They don't want you to win. They don't want you to do that shit. So you do that shit. You open up the door <laughs> wide open. And, 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 then, and then you just wait no matter what you Come on, he was expecting that. How could you not expect that? Hey, I'm playing He's inspirational fun. music. You're playing autistic music. <laughs> it's the Rocky theme. You know where he's like <laughs> running up the stairs? I know what Rocky is, you fucking retard. It's inspirational music. Okay, I need to replace CJ's picture because he's not you playing freaking, it. You freaking ruined the moment. Everyone so watch my version. See, so if you want to see uh, an autistic picture of CJ, come to my version. If you want to see, actually, if you want to see actual CJ actually come to No my one channel. cares. I'm going to put the picture of Rick Ross when he's like naked. Uh, whatever, uh, I'll just reload Skype quick right and then you're gonna have to... Alright. Sorry viewers for this thing, Cam's being an autistic spaz. I mean, he's being a cock wizard. And, uh, we'll be back on here very shortly. My lord. And I have returned. Anyway, should we go? Oh! I had to reload Skype because Cam's just like, yeah, I'm gonna kick you for no reason. It still doesn't Yo, work. It still so doesn't work. It doesn't matter. Nah, I'm you're bullshitting me. Back up. No, it's still not working. Why would I bullshit you? Because you bullshit me all the time. <laughs> you bullshit her. Bullshit. He's choking on something. He's choking how, on something. How, I want to see his version now. How old are you? <laughs> okay. You so, um, should we go into the next topic? Because that kind of went really off topic then. Um, yeah, what's what's here? CJ, I don't know what's happened since you, I don't know why you decided to restart Skype. To be it's honest, this was all kind of your fault because you kicked him in the first place. Oh, he should have stopped playing now. This didn't even game. I'm sorry. So, we should talk about the next topic, which is <laughs> where we see ourselves in a year's time. A lot has happened in a year. More specifically, for our one and only intern, JV Painoy. Pain, 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 pain
J J JV penis. <laughs> JV penis. Nigga, you, you been growing like a bowler. I swear to God, you been spreading over these niggas. You like, bruh, 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 bruh. and then um, CJ obviously hit one case. B way, you been growing too. We all been growing together. And then no, fuck that shit. <laughs> I haven't been growing, nigga. <laughs> have Have you not been growing, dude? I get like, look. What were you want at the start of the year? What do you want at the start of the year? What do you, answer my fucking question? What were you want at the start of the okay, year? Okay, yeah, bro. Uh, okay, I was in two convents. Okay, so you've grown. You have grown. Bitch, don't even talk, nigga. <laughs> but I can't talk, yeah. bro. You may have not gone. No, 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 Jay. You still this is great that you are yeah, my I mean, you're growing together because we're all family here. And what, um, the, the family. If the family. Hold up, guys. I'm a solve up. What the fuck? Okay, honestly, there was no reason to kick me that time. No, that was actually, a, that was a purposeful kick. I'm trying to sort out this call quality because I don't know what's happened. Again. Why don't you try to restart Skype again? It's not working at all. Your mic quality is slow as shit. It's uh, like 144 pieces. Hold up. This is all, hashtag, this is all Cam's fault. Uh, yeah, hashtag, this is all Cam's fault. All right. I think we should go from left to right on my screen. So Jay, do you want to talk about yourself first? Um, where I see myself. Mhm. Mm For YouTube. Um, I guess it's kind of, kind of unpredictable at this point, especially for me. I don't, I didn't expect myself to be at two thousand subscribers by the end of this year. I expected myself to be at a hundred, and that's on it. I, I honestly didn't think I would be. I don't know. But well, obviously, with help from other YouTubers and you guys, it's, it's 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 not just been me myself and I. Obviously, other people have been involved. So I guess if the support continues, Niggy, so will I. So hopefully, we got happy, smooth, clear sailings from now. You know, we we gonna get it popping. We are gonna get some collabs in there. We are gonna get some vlogs in there, Niggy. Hopefully, get some real life cinematography, Niggy, in there with some cars, right. Niggy. We got plans, Niggy. So you know, it's looking good. It's looking bright. JV yeah. pranks. Yeah. JV yeah. pranks. Yeah. Is happen, yeah. Pranks. It is gonna happen. JV pranks with the speedway pranker and the so, so flow, and straight up pranks. So flow, J. So flow, Jack, J. Jack reacts. So <laughs> um. So Speedway, where do you see yourself in a year's time? I mean, nobody told you guys. I think we're gonna be, end up in prison by the end of this year. Uh, I, I, I don't know. What? I, I'm kind of being realistic, you know. Like if I if I want to do so many parties, I go to so, so many parties and shit. I'm gonna probably end up like in a fight or some shit like that. So yeah, I'm gonna end in prison. I don't know. If I'm, gonna get, I'm gonna get a tattoo and shit. You know, I'm gonna come out like Vin Diesel. I'm gonna be okay. So CJ, I didn't think anyone could get more autistic than you, but it turns out Speedway has just done it. So <laughs> where do you see yourself in a year's time? Probably, hopefully, at around two k, two or three k ish. Um, I wanna, and I'm gonna be able to drive soon, so hopefully, I'm gonna start doing some car vlogs. This oh fucking year. hell! <laughs> oh my god! Hide your kids, hide your wife, because <laughs> CJ don't get a car and he gonna run someone over. Me. <laughs> Swear to God. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do some car blogs, hopefully. Um, basically, just. Yeah. I'm just gonna grow more. Running someone. Running someone over prank, prank 2016. Don't with CJ running someone over. That's CJ. I can't welcome back to another artistic road trip. Go <laughs> Today, I'm gonna. Oh shit, I stole my car. I stole my car. What do I do? What do I do? And he's like, there, he's looking. <laughs> Ah, uh, um, shit, just over the steering wheel. Just all over the steering wheel, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, By the way, CJ, you still got fucking potato quality, just to let you know. Yeah, but, it's all um, Cam's fault, hashtag all Cam's fault. Okay. No, I blame the mic, I blame the new mic. Yeah, I blame the new mic. You bought a new mic, it doesn't even work. <laughs> this works, this mic works fine, I mean. <laughs> well, guys, watch your man in Speedway's version, does it work? Yeah, it doesn't well, my version it. it works, so come to my version for actually good quality oh, video. For a not creative If you want to come to a version that has a good border, mine and Speedway's, please. Uh, but anyway, back to what we were saying. Uh, Speedway, you have the orb again. What do you act? 
actually want this year to be like. Okay, so for YouTube, for YouTube, what I'm hoping for is to get to 1,000. Hmm? But that's that's all. I know. I I have no expectations at all. I mean, I'm not. I don't want to say like I have no objectives because it would be nice to get to 1,000. But if it happens, it happens. If it don't happen, well. I know exactly what I mean. Like it's, it's not something which you'll be disappointed if you don't hit. But if you do, I mean, hit, like whoa. I mean, I think that the, the main point of YouTube is that we all like to do it anyways. In my opinion, it's just like in my case, it's just coming from university and doing some shit that isn't studying, and it just feels great. It's yeah, just, I don't have study. I don't have to study right away. It's when, it's just, when you get so deep into it, where it's like it's almost second nature. It's it, it's hard to explain what I mean. It's like when you get when you get so deep into it, you, and you think to yourself that you are like. I've got to make a video when I get home. It's like, it's almost in your brain. That's when, I don't know, I just feel like it's like part of my life now. You know literally, I mean? you got a subscribe button in your room, man. I got a subscribe button, like, right there and all. Like, it, it literally, like, and anyone who sees me in school or even family, they always associate me to YouTube somehow. And it's just a bit weird. But it's like, I don't know, it's just part of my life. Just like a footballer, like someone from school might be a footballer. Like, as much as they have that passion, my passion is, like, video creation. And, like, I feel like, I, I mean, I, I guess I can speak on behalf of all of us, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 My goals in the next year, though, I don't know. Yeah, I, I honestly, I think this time next year we could be anywhere from ten to like thirty k. <laughs> like, no, you could be. You you are gonna be nigga. I'm telling you, you are. me. I'm telling you. you Straight up hip hop, your channel, Niggy, you gon' fly, you going somewhere, Niggy. I'm telling you. Like because Jay's growing a lot faster than Cam in a way. I think and he's got more views. I, I think he's gonna uh, Jay to be real <laughs> you're listening, not to piss you off or anything. I I think you're gonna pass into <laughs> Not to piss me off, I would not be pissed off about passing. <laughs> yeah. I know because not pissed off if you Ah oh, damn it I passed you know? Cam in subs. I don't I'm best games. <laughs> <laughs> ah shit. No, I don't. I don't know. Uh, if it happens, it happens. I don't feel like it should though because of how. I don't know. Cam seems a lot more like he's been doing it for a lot longer. He's got a bit he more. It was three years yesterday <laughs> on this channel anyway. Three years yesterday. If it happens, it happens. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> yeah, I just hope that. Yeah. 10, 10 to 30 somewhere so it sets me up for n the year afterwards where hopefully I can make it full time basically this is kind of like the setup year almost um, I finished school in May and I'm hopefully going to university so basically setting up to a point where I can do this in university and make a living out of it is the position I want to get to obviously growing uh, hopefully a lot <laughs> that's the plan uh, that's it, really. We'll see. In, 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 I think the summer is when I'll get to see if it's really going as well as I think it is. Um, but I, I, I've got to wait, really. I think the summer is when the growth is usually at its best for me. And then November is when it peaks and then it kind of goes down until the summer again. Mm. So, uh, I mean, that's what happens for the past few years. So I guess we'll just see, really. Uh, hopes are that mate, it's a full time thing. That is that's my goal right now. I, I mean, I know I know I can do it. And just like Speedway knows that he can get to a thousand K or a thousand one K, but maybe nigga, you could get a thousand K if you want to. All you gotta do is try. Yeah. Uh, just like Jay knows, oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> just, just like Jay knows he's going to hit 1 million. Just like CJ knows that he's going to lose top five subscribers today. Wow. As what, long what? as <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Cheer your beans. I actually don't get the joke. So, right, <laughs> um, <laughs> as, as long as like, you put your head down, like you can do it. It's easy. Uh, like YouTube is something which does reward quality content. There's a few exceptions, yeah. and I ain't gonna name no names, though. But there's there's a, there's a few exceptions. But for the most part, I can't. let's see, <laughs> let's see, Craftastic Jack, he's really shitty. Uh, let's see. That's what you said, not me. Let's see. <laughs> uh, JVY Petty, he steals all his videos. Uh, let's see here. Anyway, back to what I was saying before I was rudely interrupted. Um, yeah, there's a few exceptions, but overall, I've got to say YouTube does reward good content. So, as long as you're doing good content, you will be fine. Okay, so on to the next topic. We are going to be talking about sex and how we feel about sex and what it really means to everyone. Um, 
So first of all, I've got to say, I don't feel like sex is something that people feel like they should jump into straight away. It's a very delicate and sacred, sacred thing. It should be yeah. taken seriously by people that are in a, a, a dedicated relationship. And if you feel like you crave it, you need it, it's just a bit of fun to you. Yeah. Buy sex uh, actually, uh, I agree with you. Buy. No, I'm what not. What the fuck are you guys talking about? I <laughs> know <laughs> this is a serious topic. Yeah, it's, here, a serious right? topic it's, it's, it's a serious thing that we need to address. Too many people are getting AIDS, and we need to stop it. We need to spread awareness. Yeah, we need to stop it. So yeah. to stop AIDS, my I think we should create our own type of drivecast AIDS. Stop AIDS. We must <laughs> stop AIDS. We must stop sex. <laughs> to stop sex. To stop AIDS. Now that was actually the thing. I'm gonna join the bat again in a few years time. I'm not gonna have sex. I'm gonna, yeah. That's anyway, on to the next topic. <laughs> um, the Zondaref <laughs> in the crew. So, if you guys didn't already know, the Zondaref was available for crew credits only. I think. Yeah, boy. Uh, and w when when was it like? Un uh, two weeks ago. About two weeks ago, yeah. As in, when when did they fix it? About a week ago. Uh, one week ago. Uh, it was on Monday, I think. Yeah. So Monday. They fixed it on Monday. So it was pretty fast, to be fair. People were like talking about it a yeah. lot. And then as soon as people kind of realized, it seemed like they changed it back. Mm -hmm. So firstly, I mean, people have, I mean, I've already made a video on this. So I feel like a lot of people already heard what I've got to say. What you guys got to say? You guys got a voice too. So go ahead. What do you, what do you think of the Zondra ref? It, bullshit. It's obviously bullshit, but what else? It's shadier than a palm tree in a desert, basically. Okay, so, okay, uh, so one thing. <laughs> You don't need like to shit Okay, Karam. I actually I was discussing it with, with Karam one day, I think. I think it was with you that really? I discussed. I know that I, I was telling you, or was it with Niner? I know, I don't remember. That I thought that the Sonda F was kind of like a, a test kind of field in a way, because I think they wanted to include what they, what they were doing with Need for Speed World, that you could only buy some cars with crew credits. Now, yeah. as that thing didn't work well, and the community was responding pretty bad to it, and they were talking that shit again about the crew. Uh, I think that they pulled back a little bit and they included, well, in-game cash to also buy the Sonda. So I, that's why I think it was, it was a yeah. test field to see if they could gain more money by including uh, some cars, some overhyped cars and people that people actually really want to see only for crew credits. Yeah, um, I think like they were trying to sneak it in to be fair. Yeah. I don't think yeah. they wanted the community to be respond in backlash because, I mean, they, you just released a expansion pack for the game for $30, no, $25 USD, and plus you also have the full game, and then some people would play, like me paid for the season pass, that's, that's, that's like $100 right there, Six. yeah, yeah it's about $100, and then you And if you take a say, Richard, how much did the Sunday F cost? I think it was like $26. Yeah, $26 for one okay. car. What? One car. For one yeah. car, if you want to get the crew credits, <laughs> if you want to get- I didn't even care about this. What on like, th like, what? That is I'm, just I'm really- gonna be like, Oh, I thought it was going to be like $4 or, you know- No, 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 it's actually a lot. It's more no. than freaking- um, fucking it was more I, than I, Wild I, Run! More than I Wild Run! Believe, I watched Theo's video. Theo's video, boy. He, he bought it and then he tried to justify it. How can you justify it? It doesn't make any sense. Money, real life money. Yeah. Dickhead. Yeah, big like happened, you dickhead. Oh my god. What? I, I, I mean, to be fair, it's not really. From what I heard, the Sonda F isn't really that good. Still, the Love Ride is the best car in the game. So I, 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 I test drove it. I thought it was quite good, to be fair. Yeah, but it's not. Yeah, but it's not when you're in PvP, if you use that car in PvP, you're going to destroy it. I don't care how good the car is. I don't care how good. I don't care how much YouTube money you make in. No. You do not spend $30, nigga. That's like 20 some pounds on it's a. 20 quid, Jeff. Yeah, on a. Fake car, Nikki, on a virtual car. No, no, yeah, because to get the crew credits, because it was like a weird number. Like, yeah. you know how in some shops they'll say, oh, it's like 30.99. So if you've got yeah. only three pounds or something, some dodgy, like, it will, like, they won't give you the change or something like that. Like, for bus fares, it's like 20p off the nearest to the pound. So, yeah. you, like, they're basically, basically con you almost. It was like that. So to get the nearest crew credits for it was 25 pounds, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So you basically have to spend 25 pounds to get it. Now, if this was. Need for Speed World, I'd be like, I don't like it, but it's cool. It's a free-to-play game. You gotta make your money back somehow. It's all good. Even then, in that situation, 
is shit. No, that's different. It's a free to play game. It's an MMO. Yeah, it's, but still, it's, it's for fine. a free to play game for twenty six hours for one car, that's kind of that's over the fine top. though. Like you, you, you're, you're not making any money. The only way you're gonna make money is out of the cars. So I understand yeah, that. That's yeah, whatever, understandable. Whatever. But when it comes to a triple A game where I've okay, so like CJ said, forty quid on the game, twenty quid on 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 the the season pass, twenty quid on the expansion, and then you expect me to pay twenty quid for the cars. I don't think it was. I think it was a. T I do think it was a test in the sense that they were testing the waters, but how they thought that was moral in any sense of the word confuses me. It's just plain stupid, really. It, uh, all you're doing, in my perspective, is losing the trust of the people. Like, I I know that they've put the the, the crew credits in now, or the, all the the books even. Yeah. But it shouldn't have been there in the first place. It, I paid money for the game. If it was a free to play game, cool. I understand. How much? How much? Is it in box? Like three hundred thousand. Oh no, it's not seven hundred k. So basically, no, no, that's it in cash. I think he's. Oh, you're talking yeah, about books. Yeah, books. Oh no, I got it confused. Yes, yeah, three hundred crew credits, but it's like no, crew credits. No, crew not credits. It's like two hundred and seventy. No, three hundred thousand. Five thousand. Yeah. But you see, what I've realized, games like that have a uh, microtransactions in. I, I realized they, they set their prices of the, the in-game content really high. Yeah. So That's one people, thing I was actually about to talk about. People feel the need to buy, like GTA yeah. does it, but it's kind of justified with GTA because the DLC being They've free. They've been going that shit for how many, how long, like two years now? Yeah. Yeah. Two years. Actually, it's going to be three now. I couldn't buy anything from the new GTA DLC because it was just ridiculous. You had the yacht, which was like, I think that was- Nine eight, million. Nine mil. Mm -hmm. And to do it up was an extra like 200, K like to change the color of it yeah. to put different interior in it and stuff. So I just I don't know. Money's a really shady thing. The in one the thing is yeah, okay. So they they put it in. That's cool. Is there any other cars in the crew? Because I'm pretty sure the LaFerrari is pretty expensive too. But was it 700k or, or more? Yeah, it's around 700k. It's 700k. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm and the Aguero. Oh, no, the Warrior is 400,000, and uh, the Aguero is also 700k. Okay. Uh, so. I don't understand how the Zonda, which is almost the same as the Huayra, yeah. is that much more. It doesn't make sense to me. It still seems shady. Us. Like uh, like Jay said, it's like they've put it so high that you buy crew credits because you can't be asked to, to you know grind for it. Yeah. And the car is good from what I've used in its full start version. Obviously, that's not the same as Perth. Um, I don't know. I just feel like it's a I bit... The Huayra is quicker than the Zonda R F or whatever it is. Yeah, I think it's Zonda. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I mean, in real life, it is. In the it's game, it's that. probably going to be different. I mean, wow. I don't know. I don't. I think they've lost my trust ever so slightly. I like how they've added it back in, but they've definitely lost some trust purely off, or purely off the fact that they have added it in. Definitely. Mm. Um, yeah. Such a shady move. I so honestly did. I I would have expected it from fucking. Uh, you know, I wouldn't even expect it from Turn Ten or like Playground Games. Like I wouldn't have expected it from them. Wouldn't have expected it from, especially Ivory Tower. Like after they've they've worked so hard to gain back the yeah. fans' trust. It's like oh, you bring out an expansion. It's getting good reviews. So you know what? <laughs> Fuck it. I'm just gonna do something mad shady. Like. Come on, man, keep it yeah. up. You're doing good. Like, you were genuinely showing that. You, the season you know. pass wasn't worth it. Yeah. You know, the only season pass for a racing game, which has been worth it for me, is Drive Club. Because Drive Club legit has a shit ton of cars, and there's no way they made yeah. all of them before. Or no way. The I've got to say, Drive Club has handled, I don't know how they've done it, but at, at the launch, the multiplayer didn't work. And now it's one of the best races, I'd say. I'd say this gen. I honestly, well, I don't play much of it, and partially because I'm I'm, I'm more of an arcade. I've been playing Need for Speed and the Crew. That's why I wouldn't yeah, say it's better. I wouldn't say it's arcade. I wouldn't say it's better than it's, it's arcade. Yeah, it's kind it's of like a middle. It's in the middle. Yeah, it's not it's like Need for Speed. It's not Need for Speed arcade. Yeah, but it's what I mean. Arcade racer though. But that's not what I'm saying. No, I'm saying but it's not, not really. Need for Speed arcade. It's it's kind of arcade in a similar way that Horizon Two is. No, not even then because it's. Yeah, I mean, not even it then. Looks it looks like, really fun. It looks. It really penalizes arcade. you a lot, and you do have to break. In Horizon, you just you break and you pull it to a crazy drift. Yeah, and I mean, that's it's like it, yeah, it's in the middle. It's not a simcade, but it's not arcade. It's like it's it's in a weird middle ground. Yeah, but For regardless, example, listen, like uh, in Dragon Club, it takes like a lot of time to drift. 
For example, I mean, I suck at drifting. It does take I a lot of effort to drift, yeah. But um, like Drive Club, I, I mean, I'd honestly put it as my third favorite racing game of this generation so far, over Horizon 2. Um, do you guys think that um, Ivory Tower or Ubisoft is going to try this again? No, I think another, I, as I say, it was a test field. If it worked, if it got a positive response, probably they, they were going to I do it I don't know how they could think it was going to have a positive response, though. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, if they look at Need for Speed World and how people... But that's a, that's, a different, that's, that's a free-to-play game. Yeah, but it was a free-to-play game, but that's why you don't understand. It was a free-to-play game, uh, but everything has a limit. In Need for Speed yeah. World, you have elite cars that cost like $50, okay, not kidding, $50. You had to buy parts, you had to buy visual parts, you have, everything was with uh, speed boost. Which but that's was different, the, though, because like, that's a completely different... If you, bought, if you get a game for free and don't pay, that's, that's cool. But when they release, because you have to buy the game, and then all of the add-on oh, content yeah. with it. Like, it's completely different. It's not Need for Speed World. If, I mean, if, if, imagine different. if this happened to Need for Speed 2015. Everyone would be fucking, what are you doing? Like, it, the Need for Speed it, suburb. They wouldn't even try it because it's a stupid idea. Why in, yeah. on earth did Ivory Tower think it was a good idea? I don't yeah. I don't get the logic. Does like, that make sense? I, I actually kind of hope... Actually, no, 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 I don't hope anything. But um, I, if they do this again, like... I'm probably going to be done, like, because they can't pull the <laughs> shit. I don't think going to be done. Yeah. Everything went all se serious that it doom. I'm going to be yeah. done. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's true. I don't want to play a game run by shady people. I mean... I wouldn't support them. Just yeah, in the same I way I haven't played Fallout 6. I, I wouldn't support them. I wouldn't support like, them, no. I don't need to. I've got Need for Speed to play if, if they tried to pull this again. Yeah. And Drive Club, <laughs> like... Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm I'm excited for what they have in the future. I mean, fucking photo mode, video mode. We will talk yep. about that very shortly. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'm excited for future plans. Uh, let's just hope that they redeem themselves with this new modes coming up. That's all I hope right now yes. is I hope that they redeem themselves with the upcoming modes yeah. and just clean your shit again. Let's hope, they don't, let's hope they don't try this shit again. I mean, I've got to say, the crew has really solved itself since launch. Yeah. Regardless of what we're saying now about all this shit, it's been solved now. Like, it's, that's what we've got, to rem we've got to remember. It has been solved now. Uh, but, you know, just look at the future of the crew. It's going to be so sick. All the features they're adding in, it's going to be absolutely mad. So should we go on to the brighter story, which is the photo and video modes? I think we should. Yeah. I, I, let's just cleanse the negativity off right now and just that's why shower ourselves said. with that's positivity. Said. So, Jay, since yeah. you mainly do montages on your channel, that's like your main core. Yeah. You go ahead, talk about what you want to see from the video mode, because uh, you, you've been growing, you like, you know everything about okay, the Okay, okay, like, I'm going go go in, I'm going go in. So, the crew is, right, re as of recent, is very pretty. I, I, thought, I didn't think it looked too bad before, but now it looks, it looks, it looks, wah, <laughs> uh, So, to see what we can do with a, Hopefully a free camera, like free hand, so we can move it around, change the angle. Slightly similar to the way Rockstar Editor does it. Now, whether they'll go in that deep, I don't know. I kind of really don't know what to... I don't know if it will be like a... Uh, the way Forza does it, where it's kind of like a... It's like fixed camera angles, or if we'll be able to have a bit more freedom. So I've, I've just got the thing up. Um, do you want me to like, read the paragraph that they've put up on, on their site? Yeah. yeah sure. So, coming soon, Photo Mode will give the, play, uh, give the players the ability to capture their best moments in-game. Trigger this mode to freeze your car and everything else around you. If you're playing with friends or any of the players, they'll simply be frozen on your screen and your screen only. On their side, they'll be playing and you'll be acting normally, so you'll probably just end up going into a wall <laughs> or something like that. Um, of course, Photo Mode isn't a simple freeze on your screen once you've triggered you'll have access to several settings including the motion blur exposure saturation and more there's actually a picture on here let me hold up and zoom in you can do uh, so you have got a free room camera okay uh, you can turn off like the grid so if you know you've got a camera you can use your yeah. grid and stuff you yeah. can turn that off or on you can have the car have more damage more dust more mud you can show the driver or not show the driver Jeez. you can change the time of day the weather the exposure the brightness uh, you can have time the of day. Like a drive club. you can have the vig no better than drive club you can have vi the uh, vignette on it you can have a frame on it the logo for the crew logo uh, different types of filters vocal distance motion blur all types of stuff 
And that's only one section. If I show you, if I show you here, can you see that on there? Can you see that there? Yes. That's one of about five sections. So there's more, basically. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure how that's going to work. But anyway, going back, back onto what they said, uh, they basically said that you can uh, change the weather, time of day, mood, the, the damage. Um, and of course, you'll be able to rotate, zoom in with the camera to give you an idea of what you'll be able to capture. And they've just gave some photos, basically. So uh, I'll try and show this. It's going to be a bit hard. Uh, there's one there. Oh, I've seen those, yeah. The rough. Um, that's the RU, yeah, RUF thing. Uh, they've got uh, like a black and white LaFerrari picture there. Ah. Uh. So, so, so uh, can you just, okay, just think about this. The crew has probably one of the biggest maps in it, next to Test Drive, that any car game I'd, has. I'd say, for me yeah. anyway, it's the biggest thing I've ever played personally. Like, it's probably a game bigger than there. Yeah. For me. Okay, then, yeah. Can you imagine the actual things that we could pull off with, with the camera mode in a game so vast? and so much different things to capture it. It's kind of like with, with Test Drive, I mean, Test Drive, sorry, Forza Horizon and um, Need for Speed, I'm kind of running out of places to get shots. It's kind of repetitive now because you- Especially with Need for Speed because it's yeah. got that one 360 yeah. camera. Um, so, hint, hint, not something that I'd love to see, Need for Speed camera mode, um, okay. I don't know, no, no, 2016. Well, um, <laughs> I can't, I can't wait. I'm genuinely really excited to see how, what we can do with it. I know there's a lot of people that are really talented with, with um, camera modes and stuff. So yeah, it'll be, be interesting. I think, I, I, oh, sorry, Speedway, you go ahead. You no, got, you, you, no, yo, you got I the insist, you have the orb. You the, I'm giving no, you the you orb. Got, take, oh, you, you the got the take the orb, take the orb. Okay, yeah, um, so I think, <laughs> especially for just being a photo mode, I legit think they can go in with this video mode. Like, legit go in. Where the fuck is Speedway gone? Uh, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to get it straight. I'm going to call on Karen going. So, um, I think that this could really. <laughs> he just happened to have a ball under his bed. Um, so I think, especially as this is only the photo mode and the detail they've gone into with the photo mode, I think the video mode could be mad. Think yeah. about it. Oh, yeah. I think yeah. they're going to go better than Rockstar Editor, to be honest. That, like, I mean, that is the most in-depth camera mode I have seen in any game ever. I don't think I, can, I can't remember being a, seeing a camera mode in a game where you can change the time of day, the amount of dirt on your car. The like, I've never seen that in my life. Like, it's everything you can do yeah. it in Drake, I think. Right? No, you can't. Not you can't change the time well, in Drive Club. Shit. You can't change the weather. You can't do any of that. Yeah. You've got mad exposure, uh, exposure uh, differences, and you can change the lenses and stuff. But you can't really do the day and night stuff that the crew can. Um, yeah. And that, yeah. that's why I think the crew has a much better system, in in my opinion, anyway. Um, but with this just being the camera mode and you can do all this shit with the camera mode i can't wait to see what the video mode is going to be like that gets me even more excited just after using rockstars rockstars editor once you get to the basics of it it's quite good but it's quite clunky that's my main issue with it it's quite it, especially on consoles i don't know about pc but on console it's pra it's really impractical like with the controller it, it, it see the the way the the way the edit it is for me seems to be something you would actually have on a computer, not a console. Even on a computer, like that's what I've been playing it on. I I can't say. I mean, there's so many things I'd improve to it. I, it just feels a bit disjointed at some points when you use it. And that's I just I just I just got a feeling I tell we're going to smack it out of the park. I mean, this photo mode is sick. You go wherever you want, anywhere around the map, and you can change like time of day i mean they said they've got different types of cameras you've got free room cameras what else are you gonna have what other sorts of cameras are you gonna have different cinematic cameras you're gonna have ah uh, i'm so happy i don't yeah. know I, one thing i would like to see though is like for the video mode okay it's like you know how you can do the free drive challenges and that shit that you can put put like uh the shape points and stuff you might see if you could do the same thing but in the map and you could place cameras like, I know, yeah. oh, that's that's a good idea. Down, put down cameras, yeah. So, no, no, like, different angles, and yeah, shit like that. So, you put, have, yeah, so you place have cameras problem. around the map, basically. Yeah, basically, yeah. yeah. So, like, when like fucking Ken Block's doing Jim Carner, he's got like sh shit on the map, so like, yeah, that's what you mean, right? Yeah, 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 basically, yeah, that'd be sick. Imagine, like, you could legit like, do a Jim Carner in the crew, yeah, with drift spec, yeah, 
Like, you could legit do that. Because <laughs> think about it, you got all the different types of specs. There's so many endless opportunities. Like, you could have like a, a video or a film where you start off in the city with a street spec and go to the other side of the map in a raid spec car and you end up in a raid spec car or a circuit. Like, there's the amount of cars as well in the game and like the interior views. Oh, I know we were just shitting on the crew for the past 10 minutes. Honestly, this gets me so happy and so excited. I can't yeah. wait. Um, with the video and photo, uh, with the more with the video mode, um, will we be able to like use it in PvP? Like nothing has been said about the video mode. This I, is just like just uh, talk okay. shit. They've only said uh the camera mode like like in depth what they're gonna do. I'm assuming the video mode's gonna come after they release the camera mode, yeah. maybe because I I just assume that would be the right way of doing things, and um, that's like the more chronological way of doing things. Um. But yeah, nothing's been said about the video mode yet. I just want to see what this camera mode's like. I, I can't wait to make montages with it. It's going to be so to, good. To be fair, I think that, the, in my opinion, the only thing that the crew needs now, and I keep saying this because it's actually fucking true, is a binal editor. Like, imagine if we could find, have every single one of us a different binal, like that you create and that I create. Like, the, like, every card looks different. Like, for example, I have been going to PvP lobbies and shit, and I found the same vinyl on the Nissan Skyline, the same dragon that I have, and it pisses me off like do so want, Do you want bad. me to give you a reason why they won't include it? Why? And, and it's only one reason. Like, I want, my dreams. I, I want violence as much as you do, though. <laughs> I want it as much as you do, though. The reason I don't think they're going to add it in is because they already sell, like, full-on wraps for cars, which people can purchase, and there is so many of them. Like, they already yeah, offer that. Well, it's that's like, kind of the same difference between 15. Like you have preset wraps, so people that are not actually skilled with the but you have to buy them. The people who have bought these with microtransactions. So what would have been the point when you can recreate it in a vinyl editor? It's like not really. I mean, if you're not good with the vinyl editor, you can always. But yeah. what if you are good with the vinyl editor and you spend money on a wrap, and then you get a vinyl editor and you could re easily recreate it? It's like a waste of money almost for that person. I don't think it will be easy to recreate none of these vinyls. Like they are, they are. Absolutely great. Some of them are quite easy, especially some of the tribal ones yeah. where it's just a few shapes. Well, the tribal ones, yeah, because this could be like just one layer and that's all. But if, I mean, they if could fit it in. Urban, if, you, if we talk about the urban vinyls and so, uh, some shit like that, there's some really crazy shit. Or maybe even the Ubisoft vinyl sections that you have. That's not, nobody can recreate that shit. I, I'm pretty sure, well, somebody might go and I know. I mean, if they were going to do it, I imagine it would cost bucks to use each individual vinyl. Kill me. Like, so if you were a circle is like 50 and then like a big one is like 10. That's what I imagine it would be like. I, it'd be hard to fit it. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying they won't be in there, but what I'm saying is it'd be hard to fit it in. Like, I didn't think a photo mode would be in there because it's always online, but they've, fa they've somehow done that. I do think it, it is possible, but I just... I don't know. I, I, if they were going to do it, I think they would have said in that one big tweet at the start of the year, or the, well, just before the start I mean, of the so year. I, I hear lots of people have been requesting a binary editor also, so... I've since the beta people, from me and you and yeah, CJ. Um, people have, I mean, and every time we have been listening so far, that people have been requesting also camera mode, that is one thing that we... I mean, they delivered on the Japanese cars. They, yeah. they delivered on the Japanese cars. I mean, we got the BRZ yeah, and the RX-7. It took a while to do it, so I imagine that they, they're going to release the camera mode. These no. things do take time. They do take time. That's why. If they are working on a binary, it's going to take a little bit more time, I guess. Yeah. That's why if... I mean, everything comes up from the beta. People can be requesting a camera mode since the beta. Like, so many things that have been requesting since the, since the beta. And right now, we're going to get it. So, yeah. That's I mean, I think. anything at this point after the Wild Ring expansion is just an icing on the cake. I think... Just having this video mode and camera mode, it, I, I wasn't expecting it. It was one of those things when they announced it, it was like, video mode and camera mode? <laughs> like, where, where especially come especially after the World Run expansion, there was- I know, like yeah. straight after they've already made this huge expansion with like some events and all that kind of stuff, it's like, video, video mode and camera mode? <laughs> like, I still can't get over it. <laughs> yeah. But, um... Yeah, that that's it for the crew. CJ, do you want to say anything before we go on to the next topic? Uh, not really. I mean, that's really it. So, besides the violence, is there actually anything else you want to see in the crew? Um, more racing, like with AI. 
if you know what I mean. Like, you know, in the campaign, there weren't that many races, to be fair. Like, actual races against opponents and stuff. And an easy solution to this is to take all the racing events from PvP, put them in the game, and have them as, like, faction missions where you can do them against AI and, like, practice with your cars and stuff. And also... Yeah. And also, another thing I'd like to see is police in way more events, and police have way yes, more Yes, police in PvP. Yeah. That is something I'd love to see. Police in PvP in free room? That they work with more than one player? That oh, would be definitely, sick. yeah. Yeah. One th another thing I was thinking of, I'm not sure if you guys play much of Undercover on multiplayer. Uh, uh, I, yeah. I play Cops and I Robbers. I play that Cops, Cops and, and Robbers. Robbers. Cops and Robbers, I yeah. want to see that in the Ooh, crew. That. I think oh, that could be sick. Imagine, like... I don't know, there's so many places you can go. In the city of LA, and like, it's a little square, you've got the cops, the cops base and the robbers base, and the robbers have got to steal the money and take it to their base, and the cops have got to get it and take it to their base. Like, just something like that simple could work so yeah. well. Well, one know. thing that I think they should include that, of course, we've seen it in trailers and shit, but we haven't seen it in the most clear mode, is that a takedown event. Like, you could take down players, especially when you have such a big map. Imagine if you could have a PvP event, which is, uh, uh, for example, you have two kind of crews, right? And you have to take down the other crew, like destroy their Like cars. Demolition Derby almost. No, no, not gonna like, it's like cat and mouse in a way. But you are, uh, well, it could be called Cops and Robbers in a way, but you, you know that we've seen it in... So one team's got to survive and one team's got to live, basically. Kind of, yeah, you have a time limit. I mean, it's, like, we it's not something... Also. It's not something I would personally want to see, but there's definitely a lot of people who would love that mode, I know that for sure. Like, it's it's got such a big demographic for those types of things, because it, it kind of, yeah, I know what you mean. I do know what you mean. It's like you're trying to survive people taking you down basically and you're in a team yeah do you know i don't know if well in if we speak undercover you know that you had to take down some ai that they have like a life bar and shit yeah, like yeah, that yeah, was, yeah. When, like, when they're stealing the cars and shit yeah so that yeah, yeah, yeah. no 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 when you know that you, well spoiler alert you're undercover and you have oh, to take yeah, down oh yeah 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 i know what you mean well when you're like taking down the big big bosses basically exactly yeah and yeah. you have to do that but in the crew and you would also the, with the crew having such a big map, you would actually use all the resources that the crew has in just one event. I think having being the option to be the cop in the crew could work really well. Like imagine yeah. being the cock, oh, cock, cock. <laughs> <laughs> being the cop, and like ha calling in a helicopter or oh, oh, shit. or like roadblocks and stuff. I think that could work really well. I think there's a place for that. Honestly. Multiplayer for Need for Speed, cops and robbers, maybe not to that extent with the episode, like with the health bars and yeah, stuff, yes. but definitely with cops and robbers for Need for Speed, I think that could work really well. That could work for Horizon 3. It, it really applies to any game. Yeah. I think a cops and robbers system where, you know, people are in charges and then the other team are in RX-7s, like that just, I don't know, that just, that just screams fun to me. I don't know what it is. Yeah. Um, but I don't know, I don't, there's a lot of things, I think, modes-wise, which needs to be added into the crew. Because there is a bit of a lack. I mean, they're trying to solve it with Blitz, Crown. Uh, what are the ones that have they done? Uh, well, they have now in the summit drug races and drift races, but... Yep, so drag racing. You need to have the expansion, yeah. So, drag, like, so they are trying to, like, fill that void. Cops yeah. and races, I think, is something like... So Cops and races. I did not say cock, I said cock. <laughs> Uh, but that's something that definitely needs to be solved. That's something that definitely needs to be solved. Yeah. I think that's something that needs to be solved in Need for Speed too. Yeah. Well, Need for Speed needs open lobbies. Need for Speed needs open lobbies. I said yeah, this before. Yeah. It doesn't open lobbies. And it needs like a competitive. Like, it, it, it's just, it's the same problem that Rivals had in a way. Like people didn't. I didn't. I don't remember actually doing a multiplayer race ever in Rivals. I did, but I, it was really random. Yeah, but it's with friends. But if yeah. you're doing, for example, no, you're I in like, the, I was in the lobby, and there'd be someone come up to me similar to Need for Speed 15, and we just start a race, and that would be it. Yeah, but that's. Yeah, but in Rivals, it barely did. Uh, it was yeah. harder in Rivals because whenever you saw a cop, you had to go, and it was like non-stop no, action. But then, but then like, like people in the lobby just try to draw you around with the the alien piece and try to destroy your car. I mean, that's why I mean that did. Uh, I didn't really have a lot of that. There was definitely th there was definitely an element of that, uh, mainly on that fucking Overwatch thing, which pissed me off. People taking my NOS for no fucking reason. I swear to God, you ever take my NOS, I'm coming for you, you ISIS diggy. I swear uh, to God. Probably, probably I stole it from you once. 
I swear Bro, to God. That was pretty I got cool. the Maserati, I got all the cars from Mobile Watch. But, uh, like, I don't know. I don't even know where we were going with that. Anyway, should we go on to the next topic? Sure. Next topic is JB Penis's sub count. <laughs> Who? So. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Who, who's JV? What? Ivy? Um, I, I don't say Ivy. We should play Cox and Browers, like next. <laughs> See, Speedway having, Speedway's having a hangover from Christmas. Anyway, um, <laughs> we should talk about Jay's sub count. So, what did we predict last week? I don't uh, remember. See, because nine is the, usually the Chinese kid, which remembers we that shit. We didn't predict anything last week. I wasn't there. Uh, oh, yeah, we ain't. Really. Well, he 2K this week. Well, let's just clean, just clean, clean uh, fresh slate. Uh, you hear 2K this week. I'm saying by next week, you're going to be on 2.4. 2.5. 2.6. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go back next week and we're going to see if we're right or not. So <laughs> now that is done, uh, since last week was the Drivecast Awards, we kind of missed out on the questions. So I'm going to hold up real quick. I'm going to get those questions up and we're going to answer those Q&A questions, which we forgot to do last week. So uh, I believe I actually got some on the Drivecast Awards episode too. So Same. back real quick. Fucking hell, it's a good episode of Drivecast, 700 reviews. All right, I'll be ready. I've got one already. Alright. So it's from Apple it. Slipper. He says, what car, what vehicle do you not like in Need for Speed 2015? And what's your favourite body kit and starter car? Um, I don't like the McLaren. I don't like the McLaren. McLaren is trash. McLaren's a good car. No, it's not. Fuck it's you. disgusting. Uh, favourite body kit? Any Liberty Walk or Rocket Bunny? Rocket kit. Bunny. I prefer Rocket Bunny over Liberty Walk, to be fair. Besides, like besides the 240Z with the Rocket Bunny, uh, with the Liberty Walk kit, I think that's disgusting. I don't have a, f a favorite kit. Nor me, really. I think anything which is Rocket Bunny on Liberty Walk is fine. Yeah. yeah. Actually, there are a few kits lacking. I wouldn't say they lack kits, but. You were to walk kit for the Huracan, please. Some of the Need for Speed made kits, like the one on the M2, they could have gone a lot more extreme. I the one that, the one they put on the Lotus recently. Jesus Christ, oh I love that. Oh my fucking lord, that's mad. I love that so much. With the spoiler, that is amazing. Yeah. And then favorite starter car, BRZ. In, yeah, BRZ. yeah, same, same. My favorite starter car is probably the Civic. Fuck. Kill yourself. Die. I actually, <laughs> no, fun fact, die. on my version of Drivecast, I have an EK9 in the background, so my nah, ass kind of, yeah. So now nobody's gonna watch you. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, so on. <laughs> Uh, another question from Arian Sefi. I think I said your name right. Sorry if I didn't. Um, his question is, where did your... I, I probably did, and I probably said it wrong. I don't want to like, offend him. Anyway, uh, his question is, where did your love of cars come from? What do your parents think of your love for cars? So, firstly, we should probably answer, where did your love for cars come from? Probably my... Well, when I first was like three years old, I played Need for Speed and kind of grew from there. And... So basically, I have need for speed to thank for that, and the fact that my dad had an Integra kind of made my love for Integras grow. You got so, yeah. Integra. That's really all I, I have to say for I, that. I think we, I think we answered something like this last week. No, no we last, last week last we didn't answer week anything. Four. I remember saying why about Forza and how that gave my intelligence for cars and stuff and. Uh, I re I do recall speaking about a topic very similar to this. Well, I'll just answer it. <laughs> Well, Niggy, okay. Um, sex. Okay, Speedway. <laughs> Need for Speed 2. The first game um, I play. I love cars. I don't know. I think my family has always liked cars. Not to the point where like they'd chew them. My family is very much buy them from the factory and that's how you keep them. Maybe change the rims, but that was like the far furthest they'd go. And then Underground and that kind of series. I, I played Hop Shoot 2 and I really liked it. But Underground was where I really kind of fell in love. And it opened my eyes up to like Evos and Subarus. <laughs> and it wasn't just like Lamborghinis anymore. And then that's kind of where I, I, I got my love for like fruit. tuna cars. It was Underground. And I think after Underground, my like overall kind of perception of cars was very, very different. And then only recently have I really learned more about the tuning side of things. Uh, I'd say probably after Horizon, the first Horizon. There was no tuning in Horizon 1. So like with the body kits and whatnot. And then obviously, after oh, okay. that, I bought Forza 5 and it kind of escalated from there. Yeah. Uh, even though that game was awful. It still had a very good in-depth in tuning, not gonna lie. Um, but you know, like after there on out, it kind of just opened my eyes to a lot of things. But my, my, I've always kind of loved cars. It's just been something which has been 
Yeah, same. I'm gonna, I'm gonna answer Forever. anyway. I'm gonna answer because I didn't. Um, I've always, I cannot remember the, the the moment I fell in love with vehicles. I've just always had a a thing for for the way they look. Same way someone would look at um, a female's ass. It's oh, just no. when I see a car, I get the same feeling. Remember that shit, you nigga? I got that shit, nigga. I got that shit. I'll be like, stop. We know, we know, we know, we know, we're going down in it. I have a red Porsche. Yeah, uh, this, this, this thing dusty as fuck, and I've definitely taken it off the shelf. Nick, for you no look test. at them rims, nigga. My God, this is my favorite Lamborghini. <laughs> Easy, <laughs> favorite Lamborghini. <laughs> anyway, uh, the question after that was, okay. um, the question after that was, what do your fair parents uh, think of your love for cars? They think I'm weird for liking rice. That's basically what my dad said. That's... Okay, now someone else answers the question, because he's answered. I don't know, I never asked him. So. Why don't you answer it, Mr. Talk? Why don't I answer it? Uh, I, like, I kind of already did. I mean, oh, my, 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 my family has always been into cars. They don't really like shooting yeah. stuff. He, your dad has a poor shut up. Um, my no, 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 really no. See, now you asked me to answer the question, so I'm going to finish it, you bitch. Uh, <laughs> my, my family, like that I said before, they never really customize stuff. So when I said I want to get a BRZ with a rocket money kit, they looked at me like I was mad. <laughs> and he was like, that's fucking stupid. But I was like, I don't give a fuck. Um, I think recently after Need for Speed, because... My, my dad is a big Porsche guy, I'm not going to lie. Uh, he looked at the RWB kits, and I, I think he's kind of, he's had an exception for them now, because, it, the, I don't know, there's just something about it, he likes it, so, I don't know, they don't mind it, love it. Mm. I think I think they have more of a problem with YouTube, but that's a different story. Ah, that's a fucking lie, they get your subscribe button. <laughs> no, Nick, yes, I, I could explain, but I'm not going to explain. So oh, now, no, by the way, no, no, it wasn't your parents, it was Santa. If you yeah, it was Santa. Oh, Santa. Oh, 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 Misoto. Anyway, Jay, Oops. would um, you like to explain? Well, since I lost one of my parents at birth, um, literally they ran away um, because they looked at me and I was like, this nigga gay! And just <laughs> ran straight out of that hospital. Um, no, in all seriousness, my mum has no idea about cars. <laughs> she has no clue, like... My mum, to be fair. <laughs> I, I don't think I could have a conversation about vehicles with my mum. She would say, ooh, I really want That's to... That's great. She'll she, she say, oh, I like Lexuses and cars like that. Car, I like Lexuses too, but she only likes them for their... for, for what status they have. Uh, and they, she doesn't look at cars for the way I, you, the, I would or you would. Or, so I really have a... A genuine connection with cars with my parents. So, yeah, I, I guess it's kind of a shit um, response from me. But speed, speed walk. What about you, speed walk? I know. I just said that. I, I don't think they they care. To be fair, <laughs> same. If if yeah. if I do, it's the same as Jay. If I'm like, oh my god, you you want see what you want? I mean, you want to be around what I saw today? Like I saw Ferrari. Holy shit! Oh, that's cool. Yo, you know what? I just bought some clothes and in the shopping mall. See, it's weird for me because we're like, my dad's very anti-Japanese car-wise. Not generally. He doesn't hate Japanese people. <laughs> no, he's he's anti-Jap, like, in terms of car culture. Like, I, like, he doesn't like GTRs. He's very, like, Euro-only, weirdly. So it's like... I don't know, having kind of a lot, I, I've never really been like CJ where I've been exotic only or like Nina and it's never really like that. So it's, it, I guess it's been mm. weird in the sense that I've kind of liked Japanese cars and he hasn't. That's, that was really it to be honest. Mm. Um, anyway, should we go on to the next question? I think we should. <laughs> um, the next question is from Jazz. His question is, what character would you like to see come back in a future update for Need for Speed 2015? Uh, Darius. Harvey. Uh, Razor. Oh, cross, you know, back, cross, 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 cross. Oh, cross, yeah. Uh, you know, scratch the back. I'm going to have to say cross. Nothing <laughs> that cross. would be pretty interesting, actually. Yeah, yeah cross. Um, uh, next one is from Zane Plays Dirt 3. He says, do any of your family have cool cars? For example, my uncle has an R34 with a Too Fast, Too Furious rap. 
That's mad. <laughs> if that's actually true, that's that's uh, mad. My uncle on my my one uncle on my dad's side of the family has a DB9, which is an Aston Martin. And then my one uncle on my other side of the family has a Rolls Royce. And then my dad had an Integra. That's not cool, sir. That's not cool, man. Yeah. Um. <laughs> um. Um. Oh, uh, while you're thinking, my cousin also has a Ford Raptor. <laughs> he legit just like, don't keep me talking. I'm not well, you were talking, though. You were just I like, weren't talking, little Ben. I was thinking, oh, oh, whatever. <laughs> Carry on, then, dickhead. I'm done. Did somebody just Ford? All right, I'll go. So, my cousin <laughs> owns an E30, which I think is still in the garage. He bought it as his first car. And then realised that he couldn't insure it, so it's still sitting there. <laughs> like hasn't been drove for years. Um, and my dad has a Gaiman. Okay. And that's it. Yeah. That's literally it. Like, there's no one else outside of like. No. Oh, except for like, there's like a BMW X5 in your driveway as well. That's because my dad though. My dad likes cars, so. Yeah, that's a good car though. So why didn't you mention? It's not. It's not a too fast, too furious wrap though. It doesn't matter. It's better than your kid leave the Porsche. Mm. Opinions. Um, okay. <laughs> I just want to add, my uncle used to have an M3. No. Before he got nah. the, he, before before he got the. I can go ahead and list that we had an M3 before, but did I do that? No. You say current cars need uh, current cars. Whatever, whatever. Look at him. Look at him, rich gang, talking rich about. Man. Oh, I can afford that. I can afford two asses that. in between, bitch. Oh. Anyway, do you want to go, Jay? I don't. I don't really have any. Like I said, they, 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 no, they have no interest in cars. I think the coolest car that's been in that my sister had was a Mini Cooper S. That's it. Speedwalk. I would like to say I, I have a bicycle. Oh, <laughs> man! Because of plates inside. Yeah, it's hot. It's beat it. <laughs> uh, okay, next one is from NASCAR. He has two questions. He says, did, did anyone play Motor City Online? Um, no. Nah. Either paid or free. <laughs> No, I was, I, was, I, was, I was zero years old when that game was out. So. The only person who could have possibly played that game was Speedway. Yeah, but I didn't even and know you didn't have internet. Exists. There is an offline patch. No, though. I didn't have internet. I didn't even know it existed until I saw the well before you made the history of NFS. But you, you, there were some videos of the history of Need for Speed, and they explained what Motor City Online was, and they he had like a, I don't know, a sign symbol. And I, I didn't know what the fuck it was. Like, yeah. Seriously, um, I don't know. There was um, a um offline patch that came out for it, so I might try it someday, but uh, I'm not sure. It's very difficult to find, I think. I yeah, it's think pretty it's difficult to find, though. I know. It doesn't really... Yeah, it doesn't really... Appeal. It doesn't really strike me as a need for speed when I think about it, to yeah. be fair. Um, and his second question is, on PS4, what PS2 games would you like to see back? Hot Pursuit 2. Besides, I think we should exclude need for speed games, because we're all going to mention a need for speed. Uh, so, just so, Midnight Club Dub Edition three. Okay, fuck, that was mine. <laughs> Burnout three. Speedway. I'm just taking yours, haven't I? I didn't want to say, man. Um, well, purely you just took. I mean, I can't say this one because it was kind of PS3, PS4, but I don't give a fuck. P Juice two. Juice two. I mean, you can say yeah. Juice if you wanted to. Yeah, but I never played it. <laughs> oh, shit. Never played it. No, no, never played it first. No, my baby girls, so we're we in the same boat. Um, yeah. Next one. Uh, Wait, what about Jay? <laughs> I don't have a PS4. <laughs> well, neither do I, but I still answer. But I don't care for PS4, so. Uh, okay. Yeah. Um, next one, so we try hard. Rice. He gave a few questions, but we'll answer like one. <laughs> His question is: If your need for speed was hacked and all progress was lost, would you still play it? Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> of course. Why not? <laughs> um. Can answer another one from him. Another one. Another one. That one was pretty easy. It's kind of very specific, but I, I guess we could. Uh, what if Need for Speed had an update that added more traffic and daytime and stronger cops with ZO6 add map expansion with an airport, seven challenges, missions, but here's the catch being only have an update in May or update. <gasps> Fucking, that is how it was read. No punctuation. Well, I was trying to read that how it was read. Okay. But, uh, but here's the catch. Uh, you, do you want. No, no, you said to read it, so I'm reading it out. But here's the catch. There's only going to be one update in May. That okay, no, this makes no sense. Sorry, I can't read that one. Um, the next one is from Neenix. Uh, if you could add in two European cars, two American cars, two Japanese cars into Need for Speed, what would they be and why? Uh, 
for American cars, I'd probably put in the 69 Camaro. Great. I, I couldn't agree anymore. That's def That was my first answer. And yeah. then for American, I'd also put maybe Cobra. Plymouth Roadrunner. Nope, I'd put in an older Viper. Oh, oh okay. Oh, that's true. Well, yeah, yeah. yeah I'm changing my answer to that. Or the Pontiac, G <laughs> or Pontiac GTO. Uh, ah, Niggy Pontiac. Uh, Pontiac. Who's Pontiac, Niggy? They're like the ugly cousin of the muscle one. Uh, and then for, are we doing three for each person? or oh, two I for each person? Or? Let's just talk through all of them and then just discuss some. All right. Well, so, mine would be an SVT, Cobra, and the old Viper, actually, thinking about it. Mm. I mean, the 6 m Camaro is nice, but that was old vipers oh, though you changed oh, my vipers, answer though. replace the roadrunner with the cobra r okay cool uh, I'd, I'd probably go for an older a whole older bodied mustang like not too old i mean like the modern older like not the i don't really like is, the newish the, co the cobra r is an svt cobra oh Oh, I, thought it was just I don't even know why this nigga came in talking. Like he finished, you was done. You came back with some BS, nigga. I'm talking. You always doing this in trial You made me want to leave. I can't deal with this snowball, man. <laughs> okay, so I would have like um, maybe the 2011 bodied Mustang. Um, maybe the Shelby, Shelby one. Um, if you don't know what I'm on about, then Google. Google. Go, go on Google. Go, Google. What, what did you say? The Shelby Dodd? Wait, what, the, what did you say? Shelby, the Shelby model, the Shelby, the Shelby. GT500. The, yes, that. Sorry, I'm really sorry. I apologize. I, I, got I you. don't. I got you. I'm an anus. Um, <laughs> and then obviously an older Viper. I don't really care which one, just an older one. Um, that when it was actually Dodge and not what it is now. Yeah, we are we going through? Yeah, let's go for the next one. Um, so the next one is two European cars, Speedway. You didn't get to say because you didn't get. You just didn't. You got to say it. You got to be on point. So you got to you got to shout them out. Uh, European cars. I'm gonna say. I want to see the E36 M3. That's basically the only one they haven't got. Yeah. Uh, off the top of my head. Fucking what European cars? They're pretty much nailed on the head Bentley. of European cars. I want to see Bentley Continental SS. No. No, uh, I, 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 I like the Bentley Continental. I want to see an R34 Volkswagen Golf. So do I. Yeah, but I don't want to see an R34 Golf. So do I, but I don't. Why you got? Why you? Why can't you wait till people finish their oh, sentence? R34 Golf. The R34. Mean the R34 Golf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,
I'm pretty sure that's a render. Regardless, look at that. No, that, no that's pretty cool. I like it. I'll look insane. I don't care. My I'm not be mad. But um, yeah. Uh, when and the, you, and what, what are you talking? Speak. Okay, go. Sorry. Oh, no, no, oh, no, man, no. Don't, don't give me the man. I don't like football. No, go, go. Go talk. No, the other card I would like to see, though, is the Audi R8. Right? I know there's oh my some living issues God. with the Audi. How did I forget that? What is wrong but with me? But the, the R8 right, is just... No, well, fuck the only one. No, 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 no. no. Let, let, me, let me finish. Am I the only one that think the newer R8 right isn't as good as the older one? It's ugly. Uh, I don't like it. Oh, the, the older one right. with the kind of like it had like the the chromey grill, the one and from under back of the undercover thing. Hold on, let me get get it. It's on the back of the undercover. Are you sure? Are you, are you talking about when it was a concept? That one. Yeah. Yeah. That's a four point four point two. Whatever that one is, that one I prefer, much prefer that one to the newer one because the newer one with the exhaust looks really weird. Yeah. I don't know. I just I, ever, ever, ever since they went with the plus version, it just. I don't know, there's something about the R8. Are you talking about the one they've just just announced? It was no, I'm talking about, it's been I'm in production for like two years. It was like the well, V8 R8 Plus or something. It's disgusting. Yeah, that I, one is disgusting. I, I, I'm talking talk, about the old one. If you're talking about the one I'm thinking about, then I think that was ugly. Basically the facelifted version of it. I'm not a big fan. No. Yeah. But the, the old one's nice. I do like the old one. And the old ones are fucking cheap too. Yeah. Like 40 Gs, I think, to get an 7 R8. Yeah. Which is very, very cheap for what it is. Um, so there you go, two European cars. We'll go around the table. Mine would be a Mercury Lago and a Golf. Yeah. Like the, the one from Underground One. Jay. Mine would be a Bentley Continental SS and a Golado of some sort. How did I forget that one? Um, Speedway. <laughs> Jaguar X J220 and the other right. CJ. Um, I, I only said one, but I'll say another one after this. The, the R, another one. The R32 Volkswagen Jet, uh, uh, Golf, and uh, Vauxhall VX220. Vauxhall's not yeah, it is. European. It's, yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, it's it British. Is. It's British. Vauxhall. <laughs> not right now. <laughs> <laughs> Come no. How did I not know oh. that? <laughs> oh my goodness! I don't know. Oh my oh, what are you doing with yourself? When anyway, I, when I heard when I heard Vauxhall, I always thought Holden. Anyway, yeah. that's me. <laughs> uh, and then we got lastly two Japanese cars. So um, S14. It's not in the game, is it? S14. Nope. S14. And the 350Z. Uh, that's one car that's everyone. Yeah. I'm gonna have to say. Of course, this is obviously obvious. The Honda Integra DC2, and what was my second one? I forgot. I forgot one. Honorable mention RX8. Why are you do? <laughs> what do you mean? I would have said that you pagan. <laughs> Honorable mention. You said you're a twenty. <laughs> now I've got to think of another. Oh, I've got. Two. I've got. I've got more. Okay, you Speedway, you're next. Oh. I only said one, so can I no, go back? I'll see you. You're still thinking. I, I remembered it though. The new NSX. The new NSX? Yeah. That's disgusting. That's oh. It looks awesome. No, oh. I'd rather have the new Civic than the new NSX. The new Civic's fuck the Type R looks mad. But uh not the NSX. Not Person, have, you seen, have you seen the have you seen the S2K? The new S2K rendering. I don't like that either. Yeah, I don't I, like it. I just, ugh. It looks uh, like a small uh, NSX. Just personal opinion, to be fair. The guy ain't attacking hey. your opinion. I'm just saying. Hey, you I, I, I remember. I remember what I want. I want the R33. Oh, wow. Yes, Ooh. I agree. Yeah, R33. I agree completely. Yes. Um, the R33. And then, what was the other car I was going to choose? Shit. It was right in my mind. Oh, shit. Uh, oh yeah, the Nissan 300. What was it? ZX thing. Yes, yeah, ZX. Yeah, that what one. What was that called? It had a name. Fair Lady, I think. It was a Fair Lady. Yeah, it was a Fair Lady, but I had. Oh, I'm gonna Google this shit. Is it a hybrid no, ZX? I think it was. Yeah. What a Fair Lady was it? That's gonna piss me off. I don't know the model name. Uh, the model know, name. It's been a game for like a while in the West. Z33, I think it was. I don't know. I think it was a Z33. Yeah, that one. No, I agree. That, that, that shit's gorgeous. I mean, 
on it, after with it being cut, there's so many things you can do after it being customized. Yeah, I completely agree. Anyway, Jay, you are um, so my first one is well, it, it's already on there, but it's not, um, and it's the um, the FC RX7, not the spirit, not the Spirit R one. The, the, the just the um, the FC as in the older one. Yeah. yeah. Well, not the the one that's got not got a body kit on it already. The Spirit R I mean, is an FD. I am tripping on balls. I meant the FD. Well, I, I apologize. <laughs> I meant the FD. I made a not, I made a mistake with the not this, not so we the saw Spirit good. R one. Not the Spirit R one. Just the normal one. And um, the O five Subaru STI WRX. So the O five model, not not the hatchback one. That's a lot it. of cars from like most wanted underground, like some of the ones they kind of missed out. Honestly, yeah. as much as it would be a joke, I'd like to see a Corsa in there. Do I not? Am I not like in the same vibe? Like having an underground pack? I, I would like to see a Fiat Punto. Legit, like I'm being serious. <laughs> I would actually like to see a Fiat Punto. I'd, some really, really low end cars to go along with the Golf and the um, the Volvo two four two. Like, am I not? Am I not the only one that kind of? I see, I see where you're coming with the the kind of bangers. You can have like the fucking yeah. shit car pack, and then you can have the medium car pack, which adds in the M3s and that kind of stuff. And then you have the higher car car pack, which adds in Mercia Largos and all that kind of Galados. Pure like pure. having some absolute bangers in there would be so funny. Like, imagine a Cobalt SS. Oh, that's actually that cool. make you laugh. That make with me laugh. With a body kit. With a body kit. That'd yeah. be yeah. so funny. That would be cool. That would be cool. Great yeah. video ideas. Pure <laughs> P50. Pure P50. Um, so uh, yeah, that's another one. Um, okay, now I've gone on to the latest week of Drivecast. Apple Slipper's got another question, but it's actually quite a good question and, it, and it's uh, Christmas themed. What was the best present you got when you were very little? Um, it has to be, this is actually 10 years ago yesterday. Um, when I was five, uh, on my fifth, on fifth Christmas 2005, I got the Need for Speed Pack for PC, which came with High Stakes, Porsche Unleashed, Hot Pursuit 2, and Underground. And that was really fun, and that's probably what took my, my like my, ha my enjoyment for cars and just multiplied it by tens millions. So that was probably I've, the best I've, I've, I've ever got. Gotten. This was two thousand and six or seven, and at the time I was like waiting for a next gen console. I'd never had a console at the time. I think I was PC only up to that point, and I was deciding because. Bitch, at the time, the Wii, that shit was glorious. If you don't have a Wii, then you weren't popping, locking, and polka dotting. But at the same time, I was split between the 360 and the PS3. So my parents were like, oh, which one do we get? Now, my sister wanted the Wii. She was definitely on it. I'm like, no, but what about these? And she didn't care because it was a console. It's a proper console, basically. And then, I don't know what happened. I opened up that box Christmas Day. It was two boxes. I've been staring at that shit for like 20 days. And then... It was a Wii and a PS3, and I screamed, and I, 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 I just remember screaming. That was like one of the best Christmases I've ever had. I was like, this is the best Christmas ever! And like, I, I remember watching YouTube videos, unboxings of like that, that shit constantly, because I was trying to do my research, even though they were both, both exactly the same. Um, and yeah, I just remember, just I, I went mad when I got a Wii and a PS3. Absolutely mad, that was, that's me. Yeah, I don't know. I'm a simple man. I think I, I when I, I don't know. I, I, I think it was I was like seven or eight, and I got like ten Hot Wheel cars, and they were so cool because they were in the, some of them were in the, what was it? The Hot Wheels movie, the first ones and the second one. And it was actually really high because they were the exact same as the ones in the, the animation. So I was like, holy shit, this is awesome! And yeah, that's basically it. Jay. Mine's probably gotta be my um, getting my 360. I mean, I've, I had consoles before, but it was just a bit different because I, I remember everyone having one before, and I was like, oh, I'm not part of the the, the clan, the KKK clan. So I was kind of like, oh. And then I, I opened that box, I was like, Skaaa! I mean, another one, an yeah. honorable mention. Another one. When I got my Elgato. I knew I was getting it, but just to have it and like that was a great. Are you going for Christmas? Yeah, Christmas Day three years ago was when I first uploaded on this channel. How did you I was on. Do I was on that Christmas? grind. I was on that grind on Christmas Day, nigga. I was on that. I was uploading YouTube videos on Christmas Day. Um, yeah, that's another one. But anyway, 
Last question is on my anyway is from Angel Sanchez Ruiz, and his question is: Would you rather the the crew developers spend more time fixing bugs rather than content, or more time um, making content than fixing bugs? Uh, making content. Making content. Yeah, man. To be fair, there are not too many bugs. So not I anymore. Like it's just the uh, maybe the, the the cops that they you only one can be pursued in favor, so that's kind of yeah. But it's not really a bug, so yeah, content. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Content. That's all the questions on mine. Have you guys got any more? Nah. I got. I got. Um, hold on one second. Okay, so yeah, from Win3 Apollo, how, how you guys got your intro and outro? How did we get it? We made it. Made it. I made A lot it. of fucking it. editing for the outro. Uh, in my case, Next Gaming made me one, and it was really cool, that's why I stay with it. And uh, I modified it a little bit. So I, know I always I keep changing it. Uh, but yeah. Can I download it? Nope. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, let me mute my mic quick. Hold up. Yeah. Why, why did you do that? We have to announce him that. approaching. Why did you have to announce I that? Like, okay. hold up, I'm gonna mute my mic. No. <laughs> Just <laughs> mute him. Um, we'll mute uh, him. Anyway. Yeah, we're doing okay, our so podcast. Okay, so I have another one. Oh, we got uh, another see? one. Okay. Another one. Uh, from Apple I Sleeper. Um, Look at this, guy, yeah, this guy asked like three questions, I swear moment. to God. <laughs> Dude, he's a fan. He's a, he's a true fan. Game? Favorite wheels, oh, will rims will in sure, Need for Speed 2015. Uh, if you're talking about the brand, I would be like Bork. I like the. Yeah. My favorite rims at the moment are the Workmeisters, so Workmeister oh, ones. I don't have any favorite rims. I experiment a lot. Oh. It depends what car you go with, but if you're just yeah. talking about the rim itself, I need some wet mices in my life. Yeah, they're really good. In them. Anyway, should we end? Oh. Without yeah. CJ. Whether should we kick him? Should we kick him? I mean, it's completely up to you guys. Well, it's not because you 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 control right, the. I'm back. I know. I could, okay. Well, never mind. So, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Joycast, make sure you go ahead and hit the like, subscribe. If CJ remembers to go ahead and put our links down in the description below, you guys have been awesome. How, is there any last words before we go ahead and end this episode? New Year's resolutions to put links in the description. Gummy's fame. Autism. <laughs> oh God. Well, God. <laughs>